Happy Monday and welcome to this uh, new episode of Monday Musings. So Christians all over the world yesterday celebrated Easter. So I want to wish all of my Christian uh, viewers a very, very happy, blessed Resurrection Day, a very happy Easter Day. Uh, now, the next thing I want to talk about is last week I saw a young lady at a store and she was wearing a t-shirt with three words written on it. And those three words started to make me think. And the first word there was dream. And uh, the question is, what is it that you're dreaming about? Uh, what are your dreams? And uh, are you dreaming about small things or are you dreaming about big things? Uh, are your dreams concerned only with you or are they concerned also with people around you? And, and these, are, these are some of the questions that you have to think about uh, your dreams. These are the questions that you need to be a asking of yourselves. And I hope that you're dreaming big. I hope that you are dreaming about things which do not just affect you personally, but they affect people around you. They affect people that you love. And then uh, part of that would also be that uh, part of your dream is about how can I make my city a better city? How can I make my uh, state a better state? How can I make my country a better country? And of course, how can I make the world a better world? So do not just uh, dream about small things, uh, dream about big things. Uh, the second word there on her t-shirt was believe. Now, uh, this this word is thrown around in, in uh, showbiz, it's thrown around in Disney movies, but the questions that this question, this word arises is, uh, Believe what? Believe in what? Okay, so uh, when you, you say the word believe, then there has to be uh, something. Uh, what are the things that you believe? Okay, so what is the definition of your belief? Uh, and then the second question is, where do you target your belief? What is the object of your belief? So as a, as a Christian, uh, my answer to those uh, questions are, uh, as a Christian, I believe the Bible. I believe Jesus Christ. I believe that he's the son of God. I believe that he died and rose again. And having faith in him, believe in him, is going to give me eternal life. And, and of course, that is on a spiritual, on a religious level. But then uh, you can also talk about uh, what do you believe about yourself? Okay, so do you believe that the dreams that you have, you can achieve those dreams? Do you believe that those dreams that you have are actually achievable dreams? Or are you just sitting there and dreaming about things which are completely, completely uh, impossible? So for example, if, if at this age where I am right now, if I say my dream is to win the 100 meter dash in Olympics, well, that, that dream is something that's just not gonna work. That just dream is just not gonna happen. So when you dream and then what do you believe about that dream? Uh, what do you believe, believe about yourself? What do you believe about your abilities? What do you believe about your personal situations in that moment? And the last word, I think, is the most important word. And uh, many people, they focus on the first two words. They, they do dream about things. They do believe about themselves. They do believe that they can achieve those dreams. But then they forget about that last word. So the three words were uh, dream, believe, and achieve. And this third word is the most important one. There is no shortage of dreamers. There is no shortage of people who believe all sorts of things about themselves, but there is definitely a shortage of achievers. Okay. So another quote that uh, that reminds me of is, I don't know who said that, but it's it's a worthwhile quote. It's uh, worth thinking about. It says, every morning you have, a cho you have a choice of either dreaming or chasing your dream. Okay. So what does chasing your dream look like? Well, chasing your dream looks like uh, that you are doing everything today that will make sure that you're ready for achieving your dream tomorrow. So if you're in high school, if you're in college, it means uh, paying attention to what's going on in the school, learning all the material that you can, and then uh, also taking stock of what is it that I want to achieve, what is my dream, and then streamlining your path through college or your path through high school 
so that you do get the prerequisites uh, that will take you to the point where you achieve your dream. And uh, the difference between dreamers and achievers is uh, achievers are the ones who fulfill their dreams. Achievers are the ones who chase and uh, accomplish their dreams, whereas dreamers just dream. So my encouragement to you today is uh, don't just be a dreamer, but be an achiever. Don't just dream about things. Do something in your life which will enable you to actually achieve uh, either part or complete uh, your dream. Okay, so some some dreams are only partially uh, fulfilled. Other dreams are fully fulfilled. But which, whichever whatever happens, gear your life towards achieving those dreams. So if uh, you like this, these videos, please do uh, like them on Facebook, share them on your social media. Also, if you have not subscribed to my channel yet, uh, please do uh, subscribe to my channel. So I want to wish you a happy Monday and uh, hope that you have a great week. I will see you next Monday. God bless you.